Sunshine and drier conditions are on the way later on the week, but not before one last day of soggy conditions. I'm forecaster Zoe Robinson. Overnight lows staying near seasonal norms for Alachua County, about 55 degrees in Gainesville and Waldo, 56 down towards Micanopy, and in Marion County, pretty similar, 57 degrees in Fort McCoy, 59 in Bellevue, and 60 down towards the villages. As we head through the rest of the morning and afternoon, temperatures only climbing up to about the low to mid 70s, and this is a little bit below our seasonal norms for this time of year, and that's mainly because of these cloudy skies as well as our chance for scattered shower activity through the day. Let me track these out for you. Some spotty showers are possible for north central Florida in the morning, but as we head closer to lunchtime, Alachua County could be seeing some heavier rainfall. And then down towards Marion County around 1 o'clock, that's when you could see some uh, heavier rainfall as well. As those showers continue to push through, remaining scattered through the afternoon, it will begin to clear out as we head closer to dinner time. So be sure to grab your umbrella if you head out tomorrow. But by midweek, say hello to the sun. As this low pressure system continues, continues to draw in all this moisture across the state. At the least, we could be seeing some cloudy conditions as we head through the rest of the day, as well as our chance for scattered showers. But as those two systems push through, high pressure will begin to dominate our atmosphere, and that's going to clear out all of this moisture from before, making for beautiful sunny and dry conditions to close out the end of the work week. This is reflected in my six-day outlook. Showers still possible as we head through the afternoon today, but by Wednesday, Conditions should be good to clear out, making for a beautiful end of the work week ahead of our next system approaching this weekend.